Howdy folks, day 35, no work again today, uh, the driving conditions on all the local smaller roads are just far too treacherous, have a look at this. I blame them. I've turned the engine over on the car and I'm walking it again down to the shop to get food. It's not worth the risk when you get to the bottom of the hill. It really isn't. Uh, hang on, it's going a bit dark. So, yeah, I'm off to Seven Oaks in the morning. One of our customers has asked me to run somebody there. I'm told that the main road, so reasonably okay it's just all the residential areas they look like flaming ice rinks like what I just showed you so uh, be careful everybody I'm hearing all sorts of stories about things yeah speaking of stories I heard on the news that 12 and a half million people have now been vaccinated and the direction is if you're 70 or over and you haven't been contacted get yourself an appointment contact the NHS, get yourself vaccinated, so it's all good. Anyway, just seen another car go sliding past, so it really is quite dangerous. I'm going to go for the time being, stick my hand in my pocket to keep warm, and uh, talk to you in a bit. Bye bye. I've just stopped a minute to show you this, it's a problem that we get every year get snow which isn't very often granted check this that's the pathway the majority of it's completely frozen solid it was like that all the way down from my house to where I am now very nearly at the co-op we get a lot of older people around this area if they lose their footing, they're going to go straight over. I usually find a good trick is to walk on the grass. Because there's more, uh, more grip there, but my feet are sliding underneath me already. So, uh, not great. Just be careful if you are out and about. Uh, and get straight to the co-op and get straight home. Uh, try and not fall on my ass, Which is proving quite challenging at the moment. Anyway be back in a bit. Bye. Well, I've got me shopping on the way home. See it down there. I've got me little carry it bag. I'm trying to keep my fingers warm at the same time. And trying to find a light source so you can see me. Otherwise I'm this voice in the dark. So there you go. I think there's a lamp post coming up here. Remember that guy in the TV program that was a shadow and all you could hear was a voice a bit like me today. Oh, there I am, look. That's, uh, I won't talk for much longer. It's getting rather silly. I've just been in the local shop and a uh, young guy walks in there, bold as brass, no face mask. Probably told him he's exempt. If he's exempt, then I'm a monkey's uncle. As far as I'm concerned, I look told enough to be his father. See, I've got grey bits. I nearly just went. You can see the ice is really, really bad. Uh, that gets me for mouthing off the mask of small ones. But there's an older chap in there told me that he'd just come down Hillstone Gardens, which is behind me slightly. And uh, that's not good either, it's like an ice rink. Just had another car go sliding by. So, uh, could be bad. When I turned the car over earlier, two and a half degrees below zero, it said on the old thermometer. So I reckon it's gonna get very, very, very cold tonight. Uh, I'll probably be out the door. Uh, 10 to 7 in the morning, so we'll see what happens. So, it could be interesting. 
Anyway, as I said, I come off the slow carb diet. I think I've been bored with it a bit samey. So I've gone on a more slim and well based thing. I've just got some chicken, some rice, apples. Gives you a bit more variety. And a couple of nice little treats in there as well. So uh, be good. And, uh, egg on toast this morning, which was very, very nice. And, uh, should have been brown bread, but it was white. I'm looking forward to getting into Crandall Way. A few more grass verges in there. And it, I won't fall on my ass then, as I very nearly just did back there. So, anyway, I'm going to go because my uh, hand is freezing to this recording apparatus of mine. I'm going to try and walk the rest of the way back. So, I uh, hope everyone's staying warm and safe. I uh, hope you're all right. Please subscribe to the channel, like this video if it all helps. And I shall see you on the next one. I'll try and catch up with you tomorrow morning. Let you know how Seven Oaks went. All right, see ya. Bye.